The judge overseeing Donald Trump's hush money campaign finance trial in New York has been cautioned by a state ethics panel over two small donations made to Democrat-aligned groups in 2020. This development is expected to be leveraged by Trump and his legal team, who have long claimed that the New York trial has been unfairly adjudicated along partisan lines by Judge Juan Merchan. The New York State Commission on Judicial Conduct issued the caution concerning a $35 donation Merchan made to the Democratic group Act Blue. This donation included $15 earmarked for Biden for president and $10 each to the Progressive Turnout Project and Stop Republicans. While the commission did not disclose who lodged the complaint against Merchant, they emphasized that such contributions violate rules prohibiting judges from engaging in political activities. The commission noted in its 2024 annual report that several dozen judges had made similar prohibited contributions in recent years, mostly to federal office candidates. They describe these actions as self-inflicted mistakes, highlighting the importance of judicial impartiality. Trump and his lawyers are likely to argue that this incident demonstrates bias, reinforcing their narrative of a partisan judicial system. Trump has been critical of the justices involved in his cases, previously facing censure for inappropriate comments about Judge Arthur Engeron's law clerk during his civil business fraud trial. In the current case, Trump has also drawn attention to Judge Merchant's daughter, who works as a Democratic political consultant. Despite these controversies, the New York State Commission dismissed the complaint against Merchant with a caution. In response to a motion for Merchant to recuse himself from the trial, a separate advisory committee on judicial ethics concluded that the contributions did not create an impression of bias or favoritism. The proceedings against judges remain confidential unless there is a public censure or the judge makes them public. This revelation comes shortly after a report by the New York Times about the wife of conservative Supreme Court Justice Samuel Alito flying an inverted American flag outside their home following the 2020 election. Alito explained that his wife did this in response to an insult from a Democratic neighbor, adding another layer to the ongoing discourse on judicial impartiality. As Trump's trial progresses, the scrutiny of Judge Merchant's past political contributions will likely remain a focal point for both the defense and the public highlighting the challenges of maintaining perceived neutrality within the judiciary.